That'd be such a weird video. Is it cracking again? Yeah. Ah, oh, for the love of God. Whoa, smell that. No. <laughs> I'm Amelia. And I'm Kendra. And we are Sisters Sister Sans Gluten. Gluten. We're celebrating Easter early. This one is a bunch of stuff I brought back from the UK. We shall try the mini eggs, which from the picture, I believe they have their chocolate with the candy coating in them. Also, for people in the UK, this is an Easter basket. It's a massive one. And if you get something Easter that's colored like this, like you never use it for anything other than Yeah, Easter. you have like your Easter it's basket. It's just a one, one, one time. Well, one annual use item. But we got it for this video because neither of us have Easter baskets anymore. Mine was white when I was growing up. And it had little like eggs and bunnies on the outside and then it was always filled with the Easter we grass. We might still have that? We might still have that. In so, like, storage? That's such a cool but... thing to grow up Oh, with. this is fun. There's, yeah, there's little multiple. packaging. I love mini eggs. Are we opening just one? Yeah. Wait. Okay. <laughs> what? Let me do it. Here, Get it wait, to me. I got it. Get it to me. <laughs> Okay, something's wrong with the packaging. It's not our fault. Okay. Yeah, so they basically look like the orange ones. See, but this is gonna be But they're like kind of speckled. But like, these like is, this is the UK mini eggs, the originals. But then the ones made in the US have are different colored. Okay. We forgot to poop our egg, the giant egg. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love mini eggs. Mm -hmm. It's basically like a giant M&M. &M. It's great. Oh, like a peanut M&M &M where they forgot the peanut. So not a peanut M&M. No, but like the size. The size of a peanut M&M. &M. A giant M&M. &M. But it has a better flavor. It has flavor. a distinctive flavor. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's not just plain chocolate. Like the candy has a flavor. I love it. Paprika extract. What? That's the colors. Beetroot red and paprika extract. In the US it'd just be like red like 40, blue 20 or whatever. Yeah. And this has literal like vegetable extracts. <laughs> Which I think makes them make them look more realistic. Well that's true. Also it tastes amazing. We were moving on to the giant egg. We have like literal inception of eggs here. Mini eggs, cream eggs. Oh shit. <laughs> eggs within eggs within eggs. Eggs within eggs within eggs. Okay. Now I have always been a fan of the flake bar. I do really like a flake bar. It's very fun yeah. to eat. Too. It's very it's very satisfying. Ooh, we have one of these where you sort of pull the middle of the thing. That worked really well. Yeah, it did. There we go. Uh, okay. What? And then, oh yeah. Wow, this is fun fancy packaging. Oh, oh, flake bar. three flake bars. Oh, but what was I trying to say? Oh, oh my God, it's already, it's Ooh. already coming apart. Oh dear. Wow. Okay, there we go. This is a massive reparation. Okay. So it looks. Whoa. This is cavalry. So it is marginally just larger. Just barely Okay, bare. I was expecting this to be it's massive. It's about an, uh, like an inch this but this much taller than the medium sized one. I'm a little so, disappointed. I mean, this is UK large, okay? It's not America super size large. I mean, yeah, in the US, so, like, chocolate bunnies are like anywhere from here to here to here. Like, so this I mean, is tiny. If kids really go at it, they'll finish their giant chocolate bunnies in one to two days. How are you supposed to open this? The other one fell apart. Just sort of knock it on the uh, table on the seam of it, maybe. But and then I'll sort of split yeah, like the other one. Okay. <laughs> Knock it! it. I did! Knock it gently! I did You're it on the seat! <laughs> oh my god, that was weird. Okay. I mean, this here. is just a, a Cadbury chocolate again. Boop. <laughs> oh my god. Really, you're just getting it for the sort of extra candy pieces. Because other than that, all the all the eggs are the same. If you get them all oh, the way this, this. this one's broken as well. Oh, never mind. <laughs> They were in my suitcase. My lovely flake. <laughs> Actually, multiple flights. It just looks so good. It, uh, it looks Two like points. wood. It does. It looks like a stick. But like a very aesthetically pleasing stick. And how me. Mm -hmm. The sort of ripples that they do. Super good. I feel like it does affect mm. the taste. Our second to last item, the lovely Orloff okay. milk chocolate hen with white and dark chocolate feathery flecks. Ooh. Here she comes. Dun, 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 dun. Honestly, this Whoa. this is this is interesting. This is fun. I, I like, like this. this. Yeah. It's a chicken. And it's bigger than the eggs. Like semi, yeah. Like, semi. No, yeah, definitely that one is bigger. Definitely. definitely bigger. I feel like I must be missing something. Maybe there was a larger size than this, like extra large. <laughs> 
okay, so we should just eat this part the main part of her butt. <laughs> Here, and I have not tasted their chocolate before. So All right, so I'm this excited. is Mon Montezuma's Extraordinary Chocolate. Yeah. Mm. I like that. That's good. It's like butterier and has a bit of more of a coffee. So I mean, it's car it, has I like like it, it has caramel and coffee notes. It's good. It's really good. This is hilarious. Mm, I like this a lot. Mm. Honestly, that's my favorite chocolate. That is my favorite chocolate. Oh, we haven't tried those. Whoopsie daisy. Okay, we'll try those. Here's so now chocolate. we're gonna okay. taste the enchanted sparkly magic eggs. Do you need help opening it? No. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Hold on. Oh, look at that. Smooth. I'm gonna see how sparkly they are. Ooh. Ooh. Those are fancy schmancy. You're real, oh, they're you actually really like cute. If you have like a fancy Whoa. tea party type Whoa. Look at that. Easter event, like these, yeah. are, these are actually metallic or like on looking. a cake. Oh, that'd be such a cute, or like cupcakes. <gasps> Easter cupcakes. They're very kind of bougie looking. So cute. It's fun. Oh, it's boob. <laughs> I like that. Mm-hmm. 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 good. That's a good flavor. Mm-hmm. It also has a distinct different flavor than like Cadbury mm -hmm. or this even. Like That's almost really like good. toasted marshmallows or something. Oh yeah. It toasted has a marshmallow. Sugar. It has a marshmallow. Like almost like a toasted nope. <laughs> toasted burnt sugar. Mm -hmm. Like roasted marshmallow. But I mean they honestly didn't use marshmallow in this, but like well, they made it toasted American. the sugar before they put it in. I mean I think that's part of the karma, but like that's good. And oh my God. we're back. Does my hair look okay? <laughs> no, it kind of looks like a mess. Does it look though? okay? What do you mean? I don't know. It looks weird. I mean, my this part looks like... longer because it's well, a mess. Well, it is fine. <laughs> it wait, is longer. That... But no, this part is part. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> You've never done that to me before. I have never done that before. Lives. 26 years <laughs> of us being on the earth together and you've never done that with me. It's okay. Really You're supposed to cut it in half. Just this it. is a hot cross bun, and it's wow. <laughs> it's really hot. It's very hot. Thirty seconds in the microwave. This Boom. is the waitress one. But again, I like the Tesco so one. It's a very, very traditional Easter. But if, I've seen other ones, or I've seen the regular non-gluten-free ones are like chocolate or caramel. Chocolate. There's like multiple flavors. Whereas gluten-free ones, each the one traditional has one ones flavor. had currants, and then apart, sometimes like, would have, have some sort of citrus. Is citrus flavored with? Soaked vine fruit. Where's the freaking knife? Um, we're gonna just we're try just gonna with butter. Dip it in butter. <laughs> um, to just try and get some of the flavor. Normally, we would use a butter knife. Mhm. Mm As a gluten-free bread, it's great. Oh yeah. Like it's spongy. It's soft. Yeah. It's great. Actually, I think I like it better without jam. Bamboo fiber. What? Maybe that helps with the the Fun chewy. Meals. Yeah. That's interesting. So it's sultanas, currants, and raisins. Mm -hmm. I mean, it basically tastes like orange, e orangey raisin swirl bread, you know? Like, yeah. Cinnamon raisin bread. Like cinnamon but raisin with orange bread. in it. It's good. If you have your favorite gluten-free hot cross bun at specific stores in the UK, let me know because I'm going to try to get some more. I feel like I just crashed my sugar high. We have all the American food next. <laughs> I don't know if I can take it today. Yes. Oh god. The American stuff is gonna be way higher in sugar too. I mean, so, hot cross buns were my favorite thing of the day. I mean, as an adult, I feel like I would go for the hot cross buns. Yeah. The morning of Easter, I would go for these rather than I mean, candy. Yeah. <laughs> my stomach would be like, what the heck are you doing if I went candy first? Welcome to adulthood. Cannot have like chocolate before 12 p.m. That was the British Easter experience. And we'll gluten -free see you Easter experience. in the next video, which yes. is the US gluten free. <laughs> Easter candy. There's some exciting things in it. So stay so tuned. So comparing. Price for is next right. time for another <laughs> awkward video from the fire. Yeah, that's, that's what, what it, it is. That's what it is. Wow, we did a really good job with that. Okay, bye. As you can tell, we are awkward. <laughs>